Okie dokie. And uh, what do we have here? Diseased cranberries? My dear F word 76. Every time you surprise me even more. <laughs> Well, it looks like even vertebrates got mutated in this game. Hello there, Miasma is another legendary mod that Beth wanna add to the game. Should be an interesting pick for a Strangler Heart Power Armor, right? I mean, it already gives some poison, probably affects Scarlet Stack, and we can kill better with my poisonous asthma. But actually, I just want to see the power of my asthma on its own, with no Strangler Heart PA. The description says, when hit, a poisonous DOT cloud harms nearby targets for 10 seconds. DOT or damage over time or just DOT damage increases per equipped piece. Okay. Today no other damage buffs matter, though I have bloody mess in my deck of fair cards, but I doubt that it's gonna do something. So full set of Miasma, let's go testing and equip awareness just in case. Let's go. Basically here, well, first you get tickled and then you get stinky and that is how you can roleplay as a skunk. <laughs> yeah, some sort of skunk effect. Just in case, I have no idea if it's gonna work in PvP. If you want to know from me, PvP me on PTS. What I know, or just pretty much sure of, is anti-armor legendary mod and armor penetration perks will not be helpful here. And I'm not sure about exterminator perk. Hmm, this one maybe yes. And additional damage buffs will not work here. Well, I was literally comparing pixels and it looks like the same exact damage in both cases. Ah yes, and poison resistance is 319, not 87. Once again, I want to point out that you're gonna get stinky only after successfully getting slapped. But your asthma will affect only those who are nearby. Exactly like my asthma here. The damage is fine for big papa roaches or small animals in general. So yeah, you are cooking them, but with low intensity. Obviously you can increase the intensity with a whole bunch of enemies shooting at you, but in my book the pacifist bullshit is not worth it, cause your armor is getting destroyed. And the whole picture looks like you are not even playing the game. But uh, I'm here to just inform you. So my asthma here is kinda meh. But anyways I'm glad we have it, because why not. Ah yes, another problem is poison resistance. As you can see the turret gives no F about my skunky nature. But we have a solution. It's called ricochet. And its cost is just one point. One point of luck. Bye bye. By the way, what do you think is happening over there? Looks like carpet bombing. You have five seconds to guess. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. The answer is freaking floaters. <laughs> Okie dokie, my me conclusion. Miasma is fine, but mm, not fun. And I think it's time for Strangler Heart Power Armor. Here we go. And uh, I'm actually that stinky. Ah, wait, today is Halloween. Uh, Halloween there. I just noticed, but I don't celebrate Halloween because I'm creepy, cringy by default whenever I don't want to be. Okie dokie, let's keep going. So we have Strangler PA, Miasma, Toxic Miasma. <laughs> okay, if you compare my standard Miasma with more poisonous version provided by Strangler Heart, well, we indeed deal more damage, but he has no brainer, obviously. Is it an outlaw to make a build around this feature? I'd say, mm, no. Well, unless you go with uh, auto melee weapons, it would be another story. Funny, but you actually can damage turrets with poison, you just need to get closer, like really, really close. Let's accelerate a little bit to show you what I mean. Okay, I'm fine enough, and now look at this, I can poison a turret.
back to exterminator. Passive damage is not exactly attacks, so probably exterminator will not work here. But I wish Beth could make it work, because um, why not? Let's see who is the stinkiest bitch in Fallout 76. Mummy crab versus Miasma skunk. Okay, come on, Senora crab, show me what you got. Poison resistance, nice. Okay, let's cook here. My poison is more smelly. By the way, is it okay if I punch here a little bit? <laughs> because uh, why not? Hey, I'm flying. Superman landing. Okay, so basically I killed her with poison and punches. So she's dead, right? I'm done for today. The next video will be about Tesla Cannon. I've been waiting for a long time to see if Bev gonna do something about this new weapon. I mean, some balancing adjustments, uh, PTS stuff. Big thank you for watching. I'll see you later. Bye 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 bye.